स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई विल एक्सप्लेन द पोएम अ टाइगर इन द जू लाइन बाय लाइन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल सी हियर दिस इज द फर्स्ट स्टेंज ऑफ द पोएम अ टाइगर इन द जू ही इज टॉक्स इन हिज विविड स्ट्राइप्स द फ्यू स्टेप्स ऑफ हिज केस ऑन पैड्स ऑफ वेलवेट क्वाइट इन हिज क्वाइट रेज नाउ इन दिस स्टेंज विविड मीन्स क्लियर and reg means anger now in this stanza poet want to say that the poet sees a tiger locked in a concrete cell in the zoo it is a very small case the tiger can hardly take a few steps along the length of the case he looks majestic as he slowly moves up and down in his case the sharp and clear stripes on his body are of strong bright color his pads are velvet soft in spite of all his strength he now lies imprisoned behind the bars the caged tiger is angry he is full of rage but is quiet because he knows that he is a helpless here so this is the meaning of this stanza now second stanza is he should be lurking in shadow sliding through long grass near the water hole where plump deer pass here lurking means hiding and plump means healthy or fleshy now in this this is the second stanza of the poem and now in this stanza poet says that looking at the imprisoned tiger the poet is filled with pity he says that the poor tiger should have been in his natural habitat that is in the jungle hunting and resting then at this hour of the night he would have been lying in his in the shadows of trees and sliding quietly through the long grass he would then near the water hole wait for some fat and healthy deer to pass that way thus he would be lying there in expectation of a heavy feast so the nature of the tiger who lives in the forest is totally different and in the forest tiger was free whatever he want to do that is do it 